Hello friends, myself Kanishka. I am going to present about direct marketing and sales forces. First we will see about direct marketing. Uh, direct marketing is the use of consumers direct channels to reach and deliver goods and service to consumers without using market middleman. It helps the companies to opening dialogue directly between themselves and the end of consumers of the product. It is targeted at individual users rather than through intermediaries. Company markets through various advertising media that interact directly with consumers, generally encouraging the consumers to make a direct response. In other words, direct marketing consists of direct communications with carefully targeted consumers to obtain an immediate res response. The ultimate process of direct marketing is to establish and manage direct long-term relationship with consumers by capturing personal information in a database. Marketed send birthday cards, information materials and small premiums to certain customers. Advantages Direct marketing can help sales to grow when used along with sales promotion and advertising companions. It also useful for small business to guest books, visitors list, list of inquiries. This operations rely on repeat business. Direct marketing builds relationships. It's an important tool in con customer relationship management. This shortly abbreviated to CRM. It helps to measure response to companions to decide which media is most profitable. It helps to find cost effective approach of media to consumers. Home shopping can be fun, convenient and hassle free. Buyers get good service from company like uh, toll free for purchasing or ordering goods. It provides quick delivery of goods to the consumers. It saves time and introduces consumers to a low selection of merchandise. The consumers can do cooperative shopping by browsing through mail catalogs and online shopping service. Forms of direct marketing um, Direct mail marketing, catalog marketing, telemarketing, television, Facebook marketing, this is some of the forms of direct marketing. Uh, in direct mail marketing, it involves sending an offer, announcement, reminder or other item to a person through mail. Marketers send out millions of mail pieces every year using high selective mailing list. It is popular medium as a commerce target market selectivity can be personalized and is flexible. Cost involved is very high than the mass media. But the people reach their better prospects. And cat, uh, second one is catalog marketing. In this type of marketing, seller prefers catalog of merchandise or products and sells directly to customers. Catalogs are generally in print form but can also be distributed in form of CDs. To reduce printing and distribution cost, catalogs are being increasingly made online. The products from Various companies or ventures may be combined into a single catalog to provide a one-point shop for customer looking out for a particular type of product. Third one is telemarketing. Telemarketing is use of uh, uh, telephone and call centers to attract prospects, sell to existing consumers and provide service by taking orders and answering questions. Companies use call centers for inbound telemarketing, receiving calls from customers and outbound marketing, initiating calls to prospects and consumers. Effective telemarketing depends on choosing the right telemarketer, training them well and providing performance incentives. Advantages Likely to replace more expensive field sales call, reduce amount of personal uh, selling effort, uh, reduce field force traveling calls fourth one is direct response marketing television direct response marketing commonly referred to as d or tv it has two uh, basic forms one is long form and one is short form in long form usually half uh, are uh, 
have a long segments that explains the product in detail and are commonly referred to as infomericals short form which refers to a typical 30 to 60 seconds commercials that ask viewers for immediate response typically to call a phone number on screen or go to a website infomericals promote products that are complicated or technically advanced or require a great deal of explanation case of marketing case of a small temporary stand along booth used in high food traffic areas for marketing purpose a case of will usually be managed by one or two individuals who help attract attention to the booth to get new customers case of are machines kept in shopping malls and other such places by organization to spread the information and generate orders from customers with who visit such free standing a uh, semi permanent display or retail outlet within a large retail establishment or shopping mall case of marketing sales force manage uh, sales force means managing uh, sales force involves two key personal selling to, uh, decisions which are size of sales force style, selling styles the starts started with job analysis followed by job description job specifications requirement selections joining and controlling the sales force management activities works as a system for the decisions relating to one activity results in complication for other activities activities of sales force management first uh, from uh, job analysis uh, uh, job specification job descriptions requirement requirement uh, selection training motivation plan performance evaluation those are activities of sales man uh, sales force management uh, thank you for listening